Hey everyone, it's Sandra. Welcome back to my channel. I am super excited for today's video. I'm always excited for a new video, but today there's double the excitement because it's a style of video that I don't do very often. Today's video is a lookbook video. I don't do lookbooks often. They are extremely difficult to film by myself. It's the type of video that you definitely need a little bit of help. You need someone else holding the camera in a certain situation. So Michael was kind enough to help me film this one and I hope you like it. Whether I'm headed on a beach vacation, exploring a new city, or having a relaxing weekend close to home, I like to focus on versatile, simple clothing pieces that will last me more than just a season. And I like to bring in some fun to the outfit with my nail color. I paired each look in today's video with a fun nail color from the Sally Hansen Miracle Gel Cuba Craze Collection. I may not be heading to Cuba today, but my nails are very well on their way to a fun tropical vacation, and you can also get a chance to win a trip to Cuba. It features Sally Hansen Poppy Patch, which is my favorite new shade from the collection. It's the perfect bright red for summer and the type of shade that I wear the most often. It's not too orange, not too coral, and I love how a bright red accent can liven up a plain outfit. I pretty much stick to the same color palette when it comes to my outfits, no matter what the season is. I love me a bit of summer black. I'm wearing a flowy black dress from In Other Stories, and I layered it with a boxy white t-shirt and a denim jacket to keep it casual. I also I also included some other red accents like my red lipstick which is the By Terry Click Stick in number 18 and a pair of backless loafers which are a bit of a love it or hate it item. I personally love this shoe. They are so so comfortable. Outfit number two features the same dress from the first look. I love this dress. It's so soft, it's light, you don't get too hot and sweaty in it. It's really comfortable. And I like that it doesn't cling to any unflattering areas of the body and it also comes with a tie around the waist for a more feminine silhouette. In this outfit, I paired the dress with some chunky blush sandals that I got from Winners. And on the nails, I'm wearing a fun electric purple color. This is the shade called Hunger Flames and it has a lovely pearlescence to it. Out of all the five shades from the collection, this is the shade that I like to wear as a pedicure color the most. And it lasts at least two weeks on both my hands and toes. As you already know, I'm a huge fan of these at-home gel nail polishes because they combine the ease of regular nail polish application with the longevity of a salon gel manicure. And when you're sick of the color, you can just use regular nail polish remover and change it. You don't need a base coat, just apply two coats of color followed by the top coat and you're good to go. The brush has a wonderful rounded tapered edge which makes it super easy to get a quick and clean application. I am the clumsiest person ever, but even I can do a really nice clean manicure with this brush. So if I can do it, you can do it. Moving on to outfit number three, it's my go-to summer and the city look. If you've watched any of my Europe vlogs from last year, you will probably know my love for this belt and boot combination. I wore this a ton last year and I'm planning on continuing wearing these pieces this summer as well. The shorts are from Seven for All Mankind. The boxy white t-shirt is from And Other Stories. And on my nails, I'm wearing Sally Hansen Tipsy Gypsy, which is a gorgeous hot pink. I like the juxtaposition of the rock and roll outfit with a really, really feminine splash of color with the hot pink on the nails. Next up is a romper. I pack a romper on every vacation I go, no matter where I go, a romper will find its way into my suitcase. I'm wearing a sleek silk pale pink romper that I got from Winners and I just love how comfortable and how easy to style rompers are. I feel like I'm wearing pajamas <laughs> and I wore this exact outfit out to dinner in Hawaii. The vibe was very laid back so I opted for 
an espadrille platform sandal. These are by Castanier. You can easily dress this outfit up by adding a pair of pumps and a blazer instead. For this outfit on the nails, I am giving in to the chrome nail trend and this is Sally Hansen Miracle Gel in the shade Game of Chromes. It's not streaky at all and it has wonderful, wonderful lasting power on the nails. It's a little bit harder to remove than the rest of the shades, but that means that it will last you even longer on the nails. I don't even feel like I need any jewelry with this shade on my nails. Of course, it wouldn't be a summer lookbook if we didn't have an off-the-shoulder piece. I love wearing it. It's super delicate and versatile. It works with denim shorts and sandals for a casual look in the summer, or you can tuck it into a leather pencil skirt and add a blazer or a vest for autumn. I actually surprised myself with how much I've been enjoying this hat. I usually hate the way I look in hats. I'm not a big fan, but this hat just kind of stole my heart. It gives a bit of extra shade, and what I love the most is that a hat can really rescue a bad hair day. The color I'm wearing on my nails for this look is Prince Charmant. It's a fun, bright, mint teal shade and looks amazing with silver jewelry. So I definitely like to stack on the silver rings for this one. I'll be sure to list all the pieces that I mentioned in this lookbook in the description box below. And you can enter to win a trip for two to Cuba. Now this only applies to Canadian residents 18 years or older. So if you are in Canada and you want a chance to win a trip for two to Cuba, the winner will be selected in August. So make sure you enter and good luck. Thank you so much for watching this video. As always, let me know what your favorite summer look is and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.